I'm well and uh, it's quite nice out here actually you know for winter got the woods up there and the nice thing is with my maestro and my flex 8400 that sits in the shack just here I can go anywhere in the world and even have a you know HDMI out to another screen if I but you don't need it take it from me I mean these but buttons are big big this is bigger than my 7610 so let's get some power to this I'm just going to show you put it in front of my um, my 8400 the flex and this carry handle is very convenient and the actual stand is quite nice it sits at a really nice angle I haven't took this off yet Ooh, beautiful um, so let's just quickly show you the size so here it is back in the shack there's the flex and look it's the same size as the front and the front is big so of course you can buy the flex with the front included and HDMI out and even an ATU but then you've got for me it's, I found that very bulky because then you've got this big thing if you want to control the radio you have to take the whole thing with you what I like about the flex is it's it's really lightweight although it's big it's very lightweight uh, so let's get this powered up Right, we're in my crazy room. Let's just press and hold. It's like a computer now. Once we've got the Wi-Fi connected, we can log in anywhere in the world. Now that the screen is a lot clearer than what you're seeing, uh, but I've let it focus on the frame and the knob and the knobs in here. And then, yeah, I, I just think it's beautiful. So come on then. I'll leave it live, fast forward if it's boring. Now the nice thing is I don't have to connect an antenna to this. All that is being done back at the base unit, the 8400. And um, you can put the 8400 anywhere you want in the world. I think this, I, I do, you can buy a cover for this. All right, come on then. Don't have to press anything. Right, there it goes. Basically a computer, isn't it? All backlit, but all backlit these buttons anyway. Right, let's connect to Wi-Fi. So I'm just gonna literally do as it says. I'll connect to one of them. Connect, put my password in. And remember, the, the good thing about this, this, the smart link, so I'm gonna put my password in, hit connect, is doesn't matter where you are in the world, you can do this. And once you set up SmartLink, which takes two minutes, you're using your radio at home um, anywhere in the world. So we're going to go connect. I need to find a space for this now. Right, it says no radios available at the moment. I'm going to log in here to SmartLink. Username, password, and just so you know, if if I had my my Flex eight four hundred on my local network, it would have found that. But I, I'm using the worldwide system, which is SmartLink. Right. As soon as I logged in, that came up. It's now found my Flex, and we're going to highlight it, hit connect. Let's see what happens now. You have prompts here. There may be new firmware to download. It is telling me to update. I am going to do it, and that is the latest one, 3.10. See if I can dim this down a bit. So we're going to go update, let it do its thing. Yeah, about 10 says there. It's going up a bit. I saw the other day, it was like, it is a while. So I'll pause until it comes back on. I've had to reboot it to uh, during the update, so let's try it now. Go like that and then go connect. Ooh, uh, more firmware updates where we've got a tick there. So I'm gonna click run. Get to this window. Oh, I hit a click, yo. That is beautiful. Speaker here sounds fine. Just let that load up. Ah, oh, that is a nice display. Okay.
I don't actually use 20 meters very much. Now, they call it slice, a slice frequency flag here. Each flag, and this is touchscreen as well, uh, has controls. I'm just going to go through. I'm not really teaching, I'm just doing. See that? Antenna receive, transmit antenna. Tap the frequency, or you can press this, I believe. Oh, it's not doing it for me. I saw that you can press this. Ah, there it is there. You have to press and hold. And go 40. You can change all these colors. I prefer using this in this way as opposed to the computer, to be honest, because I'm just a, I'm a button pusher, I'm a, you know, a knob turner. So, slightly off. You see it's showing, I have got the battery on order now, in the end I just thought, well, I, d I don't want to be lugging around that cable all the time and the battery lasts for 10 hours so we've gone for the 8400 flex which means you can have two flags at the same time let's see if i can get one on press and hold will it let me yeah create slice oh. da, da, da. tnf that's notch filter Let's have a look what this does. Meters. Look at that. I like that. <laughs> Tap that, they go back in. Display. Just that, your colors. You tap anything else and it goes. Let's tap here. Okay. All, you've got radio function buttons or not used at the moment network audio transmit tx band settings phone cw xvtr pro force memory usb cable spots you can actually bring in your spots in as you know I, i'll learn it We're already multi and GPS. My 8400 does have GPS installed. So, in theory, I could reply. I've got my actual microphone connected to my Flex 8400 base model. Um, power wise, I did see power. Just here, look. See the power just changing there. So give it about 40, and there is a tuner. Now let's go 50. ATU here. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Sorry. So one touch and it started tuning. Hopefully, I won't get told off. Apologies. M0 FXB. Now oh, they seem fine. A and B. What if I press and hold? Receive. Oh, you you can move the TX, so you know which one you're TXing on. Let's move that one to a different band. That one's on twenty. I want the other one to be on a different band. Okay, well I'm tuning here with the right hand knob and then there's your A band. Yeah, so I would say I'm not hearing that at the moment. I need to tinker with this longer. Um, TX receive, see that? A, B lock. I press. There is a press function there. 
See, it says B menu clear, A menu clear, power, your bandwidth. Okay. Very, because what they've done is they've put everything that you actually use all the time. What do you press? Oh, these are all press as well. See that? Unprogrammed at the moment. HU tune, just for tuning. And that isn't that a TX? Yeah, it is. Right. I think that's enough because this is just an unboxing video. I'm going to play with it for a while. Learn how to get because you can get two scopes on at the same time, can't you? And um, come back with more videos. Bye for now.